Is there another tape on my person? There is. So let me try that one. There we go. Oh, he just... he Oh, he fucked Molly. So Molly was lying. This is the last I can give you. Why? Overson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? So he taped that? Well, shit. Let's get the fuck out of here. You don't need those tapes anymore. We already know what went down. That was cool. He just like wee. He was like moonwalking. Oh. Jesus Christ. Oh, scared the shit out of me. Yeah. The fuck have you been? She tends to do Sightseeing. that. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. No, bitch. No, I'll shoot you right here now. I'm just kidding. <laughs> You're not funny. Should we tell her about the tape or you know? There you go. Put it in my magical back pocket. What's that? Nothing. You quit with the act, Molly. I know you from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? You have held. You anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth. Are we really gonna do this now? I guess we don't have to. I used to live here with my sister. Okay. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic. By Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. Jeez. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. Ah, oh, damn, Molly. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? Oh, God. A bell. Okay, no one's at the door, and there's no act there. Jesus. Oh, Jesus! Shit. Sorry, sorry. What the fuck are you doing? By those bells, and then I heard someone coming. What the fuck are you doing out here? Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. We found this. Where did you get that? It's from the door. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway. You idiot. Oh, no. Shit. oh god. Please shoot this fucker. Oh my god, I couldn't get a shot. Oh. Was it me? Go, Clem! And Ben just sitting there, sitting Shiva down the hall. What the fuck is going 
going on? They're Shh. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! This is my fault. All my fault. The hell's he oh, doing? God. Yeah, we talked about this. Actually, we didn't because we didn't have time. Shut up, man. Whatever you did, save it for later. Shut the fuck up. Fuck you, Lee. I can't do this anymore. Yo, Ben. It's been me all along. Putting all of Take the bass out your voice, put some bitch into it. Shut up. It's all me. Oh, God. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Oh god, we don't have time for this. Kill him later. Kill him, man. I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kitty, listen to me. You can whip a skinny little ass like <laughs> Right now, we gotta go! Oh yeah, he took the base out now. Seriously. We sold out later. And it's not your boat, it's a group boat. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Well, I vote we leave it. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well, but all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? Oh, Clem. Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. He left you to die He's in that street. Friends behind. That's my vote. He left you behind. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen enough of Crawford to know that becoming like them is the beginning of the end. I vote Ben stays with us. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? Bitch! Nope, you don't get no say, bitch. Now can we go? Damn right. Burn it. Come on. Door's not closing. So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's gotta be a way out down here. Oh! No! You sure he's dead? Oh god. Oh, you S. Oh no, I'm bit. I'm bit. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I figured I I shoot as many as I could before I, I walked away, but obviously I did that wrong. Oh great! Now I'm stuck. Oh. Oh god. Oh my god, I can't I can't see my leg. Okay. No more coming. Okay. Okay, more coming. Uh more coming. Okay, let me let me get down to my leg. Okay. 
Oh my god! Okay, someone's shooting up there. Thank you, Krista. I got, now I got axe, bitches. Oh my god. But we don't got time for huggies right now. We hug it out later, okay? Down. Yes. So I won't say anything. I just do it. Just make it short because I was in the middle of a. I just want to. Just in case I have to cue it up. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Yeah, Ben. Bring ass, Ben. Okay, this bell is automated because no one rang that. Oh, no. There's a. Oh, okay. He ringing the bell. Oh, shit. Well, he was smart. He hung himself from the bell. Oh, oh, okay. He dead. Oh, Ben. Ben. See now. I don't know if I want to save you, Ben. You kind of an asshole. I, I, I agree with you, Ben. Ah, oh, Kenny. Kenny. Now you're making me rethink my decision, Kenny. I know Kenny want me to let him die, and I want to let him die, but I don't know now. Oh my God, Ben, why the why you how you making this more difficult, Ben? Oh my God, bitch in flannel. Oh my God, pull him up, pull him up. Clem Clem said, "Don't leave him behind. I won't leave him behind if I can say." Yeah, why? Why did I? Because of Clem. Only for Clem. Just for Clem. Hashtag it, people, for Clem. Okay, we're back in the house. Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! He ain't dead. Uh-uh, girl. Don't play with me. He looked bad. Swallowing. You okay, kid? No, he's not. I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind, but we had the chance. <laughs> Guys, come on, Kenny. Don't look at me like that. Here. Don't. Let someone else tell you. Yeah. We got work to do. Yeah. Okay. Fix the boat. With a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on you. Let me know if you need anything. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Okay. Sorry about Brie. She smelled like cheese. Don't beat yourself up over it. There was nothing you could have done. Yeah, yeah, I know. You want to know the worst part? No. I don't feel much. I mean... Yeah, you was hugging all up on her. I lost my daughter. And I lost my friends in those first few weeks. Yeah, numb. No. It's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now. It is. It's the, just you know. That's the human condition. You get used to it, you keep it moving. I, just want to talk to you about. I know you care about Clementine. 
Yeah. Everyone can see that. Mm -hmm. I know you want what's best for us. Don't but, this but what? Of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination. Do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Better than staying here. I don't. So I want to make you an offer. No. No, I don't want to hear it. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands. No, you won't. Me, no. Well, well, no. 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 Nah. Mm-mm. She'll be safe with us. Walk safe away, Vernon. She will be if she stays no. With you, I promise. That's no. what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one whoa, else whoa. Here, we'll tell you that, then I will. Why are you trying to throw it into my face that I'm not her daddy? That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. For real. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is going to wind up dead. You hear me? Word. Take your hands off me. Okay, but stop saying stupid shit. Didn't mean to get all violent with the old doctor, but he pissing me off. Where is Clem? Yeah, let me go talk to her. Me and Clem are a team. Ain't nobody breaking us up. Molly, Molly, where your ass going, Molly? Fun. What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you aren't. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded, and I never did like the water. Mm -mm. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own, anyhow. She's probably right. She's like that Daryl Dixon type. Much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me. I wonder if we'll ever see Molly again. I kind of like her when she's not being a little pisshead. And you be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Yep, that's why I plan on staying with her and taking care of her. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. Hey, I, I think there's a little luck involved. Oh, Clem, I gotta talk about everything with her now. We gotta have our little hug it out session. Kenny's working on the boat. Yep. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? We don't know yet, sweetie. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We always do. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Cause Ben's messed up in his head. Which he is. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Oh God, sweetie. No, no, sweetie. I want to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, sweetie. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to lie to her, but I don't also want to go to the extreme of saying, sweetie, I'm pretty sure your parents died when they left that message on the phone. Because that's just heartbreaking. No, why would you leave the walkie-talkie? No, let me click it. Let me click it. Let me take it back. Why would he just... Oh, my God. And now he's going to sleep? You're supposed to keep it on your person at all times. Oh, God. Clementine? 
one time. Great. <laughs> Fucking great. Come on. Don't even be stupid. You already know. She went to go look for them. No, where is everyone? know what's gonna happen so I'm gonna jump out and no matter what I do I can't stop it but I'm not just gonna reach out for it I'm, I'm gonna go look at the trash bin first god damn it oh 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 I thought it was time for queuing. Not pew pewing. Alright, there you go. Got the walkie talkie. Not as blood on her hat. Damn it. Oh, God, Lee. I remember the first time I played through this, and. I know. I know. We're not gonna lie. We're not gonna lie. We gotta keep it real. Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee, where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? Clark. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. I know. There's no chance she just wandered off. We should cut it off immediately. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. The walkie talkie dude. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust him. Vernon not the walkie talkie dude. on your side, Kenny. You know I care about Clementine. I am a Christian man. And I keep asking myself, if this was me, asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? There's been plenty of times you ain't been. No, that's not true. I've been there for you all the time. Yep. Yeah. 
Yeah, with that other kid and the dog. We crunch you up in that little hole. Let's go. I could have had Ben. I don't want Ben. Fuck Ben. Ben is not a reliable person. I saved his life. I don't owe him anything other than that. Let's get up in this hole. Why do I got to go first? That's why the black guy dies first in all the movies. No one here. It's freaking deserted. Vernon and the gang is here. I'm bit, damn it. We need to chop off my arm. I think it's too late now. We need to take like my whole shoulder. Or maybe it's already too late. It's already in my bloodstream. Oh god. Zombies on parade. Oh my god. Oh god. Are you all right? Where are you? Sweetie? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Who is this? Jesus. Oh my god, I literally had to choose them carefully. What do you want from me? To be continued. The Walking Dead, episode 5. No time left. Oh, and there's no damn preview. I mean, I already know what's basically gonna happen, but, you know. Okay, we killed the kid in the attic. We had to. Uh, we didn't lie to Vernon. Nope. We brought Clem with us to Crawford. Uh, we didn't let Ben fall to his death. And we revealed the bite to the groove. We're in the, um, majority instead of minority this time. I think last time I, I made a couple of decisions that not everyone would agree with. But this was really good. I'm excited, nervous, and anxious for part five. And I'll try to get these videos out a lot sooner because I want to play 400 Days. I haven't played it yet, even though I already have it. So 13% of us got Omid, Krista, and Kenny to come with us. Who was the majority? The majority is that 16% of you get everybody. I didn't want Ben to come with us. I don't like Ben. In fact, 10% of you only got Ben to come with you. Y'all fucked up hard. Because Ben, you might as well have just been in that 6% and went by yourself. I, I don't know what the situation was, but I'm glad I got the good people to come with me and Ben no good ass stayed with the boat. Even though I'm sure he's going to be the reason the boat is gone. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video, and if you liked it, don't forget to hit the like button, comment, and subscribe to my channel.